This is an Efficiency is Everything article summary on infinity calories per dollar. Now, these are mathematically infinity because if you don't spend any money, you're going to be dividing by zero in our calorie per dollar calculation. So these actually are infinity calories per dollar. Um, so some ways to get it. I'll start with socially acceptable forms. You can get food at work. So maybe someone at work brought in donuts or bagels, or you guys have a pizza party, those kind of work events, or say the boss is buying lunch. That is infinity calories per dollar. You can also get free samples. So a place like Costco or Sam's Club gives away free samples. You can also request different food items, either over the internet or through the mail. I know we've gotten some free meals uh, by giving people a bunch of personal information. Um, and then there's also free after rebate. So if you're willing to put the effort in, you can get a few dollars back on food. Now there's also labor intensive ways. You can garden, you can hunt, you can forage, you could beg. Um, and I've been to enough volunteer events to know that if you're going to spend a few hours at a volunteer event, usually they'll give you food. So again, no money, so you get infinity calories per dollar. Um, there's illegal ways like stealing food. There's not really free ways. So for instance, a buy one, get one free. That one can kind of work if you were going to buy the item anyway. Might as well get the free version. Coupons can do this as well. Now, there's also a reward and birthday programs. So we've gotten free food from these. But do know that these are marketing tricks. The idea isn't for you to actually get free food. It's for you to become uh, a customer there or bring your friends so then they can pay money. So then I have some not free ways, but they are probably infinity depending on how you calculate it. So for instance, an all-you-can-eat restaurant, once you pay, you know, the sky's the limit. Although I think maybe for some calculations, you could assume you're going to eat no more than four to 6,000 calories. I think that's, then it wouldn't exactly be infinity calories per hour, but there's a potential. Uh, free refills. Going to weddings, I would say, counts because you're probably going to go to the wedding anyway, even if you have to give a gift. Um, going to restaurants and getting things like sugar packets, coffee creamer, candies, mints, condiments. I even heard the Parmesan cheese from pizza places can be used to make grilled cheese, you know, if you're in that point. Um, and potentially as they bring out, say, bread and olive oil or chips and salsa, those, those are potentially infinity. So... Uh, hope you found those interesting. Maybe you found them useful. I would stick to the socially acceptable ones if you're going to go this route. But take care, guys.